Foam Jack. The Super Bowl just happened, and uh, the Ravens beat the 49ers 34-31. So, good going, Ravens, but I'm not here to talk about any of that. I'm here to talk about the Iron Man TV spot. Now, this is a uh, review of first the TV spot and then the extended Super Bowl spot. Uh, Marvel kind of does that for the marketing ploy, so let's begin. You had the TV spot, which is 30 seconds long, and the TV spot's not that great. And it's sad that it's not that great, because uh, that's what most people probably saw. And the thing is, you have the plane, it explodes, Iron Man's flying through the air, and he's capturing people, and, I mean, catch, catch saving, whatever. And what he does is, you know, he's he asks Jarvis, Jarvis, how many people can I save? And or carry a time or whatever. And Jarvis is like four, and he's like, oh god, because there are 13 people in the air. And he starts saving people, and that's it. Trailer's done. And I thought that was really bad on Marvel's part. But, but, okay, maybe people out there enjoyed it, but I'm here to talk more about the extended. Super Bowl TV spot, which is so damn good. You have no idea how good the extend uh, TV spot is. It, it starts off just Robert Downey Jr. staring at the screen for 10 seconds, and he's like, that's a little more extensive than extended. And I thought it was really funny, and it moves on. And, yeah, there are a lot of things that... Um, you've seen in the older trailers that tend to reappear in this one uh, such as you know the the helicopter shooting up the house uh, Iron Patriot whatever and you know so of course you're gonna get some of the older footage because they don't want to release everything but the newer stuff is also badass get a different angle of the explosion and then you get to see the Mandarin and the Mandarin says I forgot the dialogue it's something like you know, it's a it's a chilly villain dialogue. I, I, sh I actually want you to enjoy that dialogue when you watch it. And then he hits the table and boom. You know, you get the montage. Get, you get everything in the one and a half minute extended Super Bowl trailer. And I think Marvel should have spent $12 million and just had this instead. It would have been a lot cooler. And uh, Iron Man says, I'm sorry for putting you in harm's way. You get to see him take off the Mark. Well, this is probably the Mark 8. They're, they're calling it the Mark 47, but in my mind, it's the Mark 8. You've had seven earlier suits, whatever. Are you excited for Iron Man 3? And what do you think of the Super Bowl spot and the extended one? Anyways, guys, it's Mr. Film Jack. Comment below. Let me know what you think. And subscribe, like, and stay tuned.